Well, good morning everyone. It is something a little bit different today. I'm gonna to show you what it's like for a Friday at the British Touring Cars. We're gonna go in, uh, see all the boys and girls of the team, walk you through all the car and stuff and how everyone sets up for a Friday. So yeah, let's get going. We're in the Skyline. I always tend to use the Skyline for a Friday at Brands just because it's close and I enjoy obviously driving it as much as I can, especially when the weather is absolutely beautiful. So I was out on it all last night having a bit of fun. So yeah, it really is a joy. But anyway, let's get to Brands. Let's check it out. Right, we have arrived. Brands Hatch for the British Touring Car Weekend. We're so lucky with the weather, honestly. It's absolutely stunning so far and it's set to be a hot one but we will see. So it's gonna get nice and hot in those uh, in those cars this weekend, that's for sure. But, yeah, let's get in there. Look forward to seeing everyone. We've got quite a busy day for a Friday. We've got, um, we've actually got a school trip for HP. So a load of HP um, staff are, are coming and they're bringing um, a load of local schools in um, you know, a load, load of kids in to sort of show them around and get them involved in a sort of HP initiative, which is awesome. So me and my engineer Craig, um, we're going to be doing a lot this morning with them. Probably not going to be able to show you any of that, but um, still, it's a really nice thing to do. And then, yeah, we'll get down to the garage, um, see Dom, Jarps, Emily, Grumps, Craig, of course, and... Um, yeah, look forward to showing you around. The car is looking absolutely mint. They've been cleaning it all day pretty much. Setup's all done, ready to rock and roll. Dom, Dom's got the shades on. Ray's on the quad. Always. Always on the quad, mate. Look at you, tearing. He should not be on that. He's nearly run. He's nearly run someone over. <laughs> Have you had a good day, Dommy? Yeah, it's been lovely. Yeah. Lovely in the sun. What have you been up to today? What have been up to? Got here, set up the garages, cleaned all the garages, make it look nice for the tours that happened this morning. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We then set the patch up for the car for the weekend. We then had to wait for the ITV camera to be fitted. That's true, yeah. So I got the onboard cameras this weekend. So um, yeah, hopefully we get lots of cool onboard footage Fingers or crossed. it's going to be awful where you just watch me getting taken out. It'll be one or the other. Fingers crossed, yeah. Fingers, Fingers crossed, not the second one. Not the second one. And then yeah, set the car down and now we're ready to go to the toker patch to make sure we are legal for the weekend. Exactly. So the toker patch is what the, well, what the guys do is they take the car um, all the way up to the very end, which is where the toker patch is. Now the patch is just a set of scales uh, and it's the official point in which they do the ride height checks and all of that. So during the session, um, there's like a traffic light system. So if you're coming up to the traffic lights uh, and it's red, then obviously you've got to pull over and stop and the uh, toker officials sort of direct you basically um, and tell you where you need to be and what you need to do. So um, yeah. They're going to go up there now and they're just going to make sure the car is legal um, prior to obviously when we go out for, for FP1 and FP2 in the morning. So yeah, they're just getting it ready now. It looks like it's it's ready to go. Um, it's very shiny. Emily's been, you've been cleaning all day, haven't you, Em? Yeah. Yeah? Uh, yeah. I mean, it looks good. I'll give you that. So your efforts are not in vain. Yeah, exactly. Jarpsy, you all right? Yeah, I'm blessed. Yeah. How's all your your prep gone today? Yeah, it's pretty easy. Got got here in the guy just built when I got here, so it was lovely. Easy, yeah. So yeah, Dom and a few of the other boys did all yeah, the prep. Yeah, Dom and Ratty. Yeah, Dom and Ratty did everything, and then he was just rocked up and fitted some rear pads, and that's about it. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> yeah, sorted. Easy, easy day for me, Friday. Exactly. Go over here and fit some pads. That's a job that's done. Yeah. So yeah, they're going to go and take the car at the patch now, get it all ready to rock and roll, and then we're good to go in the morning. Yeah. 
So this is pretty cool. They're doing an ITV feature. So Tim Harvey is driving the Ford Focus, which is next door. Um, and he's seeing what, there's Rob, and he's seeing, uh, seeing what it's all about. So it'd be quite good for a, a current commentator to drive a current British touring car, as he is doing now, and give his view on it. And also I think that'll help his commentating, you know, when he's, when he's seeing the action when we're racing. Because he'll have an understanding then of what a car, um, or what a current touring car is like. So then it's time for us to have a little look inside the West Surrey truck. There we go. <laughs> so this is Adam's spot. He always loves looking at his laptop, doing his emails. Colin's down the end. Hi right, Colin. You're doing his revision, yeah. I must admit, Colin's very good at doing his revision. He's always got his notepad out and having a little look. Um, and then this is my side, so uh, a little bit more spread out. Um, at the start of the year, it's sort of pickings as to who, who goes where, but uh, I've nicked Stephen Jelly's place because he was always here last year. So yeah, that's a little look. And then you've got media, data guys down the end. That's data Rob, my engineer. Um, and then these are all the hats we have to sign as well. So quite a few hats we have to do. We always like, oh, do we have to? I don't know how many hats there are there. There's a good sort of hundred or so, I reckon. But yeah, not the funnest job in the world, but it's got to be done. World's best taxi driver, Simon Hill. Most handsome, I think you mean. You're not the most handsome. Okay. I get my good looks from my mother. <laughs> That's true. I can't argue with that, actually. That is very true. Exactly. All about your blistering speed. Um, as well? I don't know where that comes from. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Sure you don't know where that comes from? No. No clue. Sorry. So I don't get blistering speed or good looks. Any of it. No. What about charisma and charm? No. Hard working. Hard working. Is that it? Hard, hard working. Washing machines work hard, but they're not very interesting. <laughs> but that's about it. I'm just basically like the father of a washing machine. That is... No, you're not. You're not. You're better than that, I promise you. Yeah, dishwasher. Dishwasher. Fucking hell. Old terrible buggy driver. What are you about? There's George. Hi, George. There you go. Nothing wrong there. Taking too much speed. Thank <laughs> you. 